Okay, Madhasar, this is your speaking test of the International English Language Testing System and I am Sidra conducting your IELTS speaking examination. May I have your full name, please? May my full name is Madhasar Saif mm Khatak. -hmm. What should I call you? May you could call me Madhasar. Okay. Um, Madhasar, may I have your identification, please? Do you have? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, in the first part of your speaking test, I would like to ask you some questions related to you. Yes. Uh, first, tell me something about the place where you live. Where uh, I live in Mansera, hmm. it is located in province of KPK of Pakistan, and uh, it is very famous for its greenery. Hmm. And it's uh, tourists from all over the country and from foreign, uh, also from the foreign countries, hmm. visit those places, and very uh, famous for its tourist places. And it is near to Abbottabad. Why are you taking your IELTS examination? Well, uh, IELTS is the main gateway to uh, study abroad, mm -hmm. and IELTS uh, like uh, these are the qualify uh, eligibility criteria for those countries uh, like who, uh, universities that you uh, have to qualify this test. Mm -hmm. So, uh, do you like animals? Yes, I like animals. Like mm -hmm. uh, animal, animals, I like mostly the dogs. Uh, different. Uh, category like uh, I like the German Shepherd mm -hmm. because uh, uh, they have uh, brown, brown skin and they are very sharp. Mm -hmm. They are very, uh, you can say, uh, environment friendly and they are very environment. So that's... What kind of pets do people have in Pakistan? In Pakistan it's very to person to person mm -hmm. because people have own choice. Like uh, in, I mostly see that uh, people have cats, dogs, and uh, parrots also so they uh, vary from person to person and do you think that animals should be kept in zoos yes uh, i think that animals should be kept in zoos because mm. uh, uh, many children and many uh, young uh, generations that they uh, feel very uh, good about that that they are but not in a that way that like, uh, it be, should be conserved in a proper way mm -hmm. but giving a proper food and proper shelter to them like uh, they have to not be uh, uh, treated so rudely they have to kept in this preserve it and to give them also that these are also the living creatures okay. we should protect them and did you have a pet when you were a child yeah, I have a pet and I have a parrot as mm -hmm. well. That parrots, I like the parrots the most. I have the green parrot, which has a uh, uh, long tail, mm -hmm. and I kept it in my room. What kind of animals do you think are best pets? Well, uh, the best uh, pets should be like uh, the dogs. Dogs are, uh, as I told you earlier, that these mm -hmm. are very friendly and uh, they can, you can uh, play some games with them like uh, saucer and uh, throwing like balls and uh, you can play with them and also they understand our language they they are very friendly to environment and also mm -hmm. uh, they has many like they are very sharp and they are very uh, active about surroundings so they can tell you that what is going around us and they also save us from enemies okay let's move to talk on birthdays how do you usually celebrate your birthday ceremony? Oh, well, ma'am, I usually celebrate uh, if my birthday, like I invite my uh, friends mm -hmm. and uh, I, I arrange some uh, like uh, uh, plane and I, I made some plane for the friends and I decorate my room with balloons and uh, mm -hmm. to give them uh, like surprise and uh, to make uh, and I spend quality time with my friends and my families also and uh, I give them and they give me some uh, uh, gifts and they gave me some like uh, good deeds for my future. Okay. So in this way I celebrate my birthday. Do you think it's important to give someone gift when it's his or her birthday? Yes, it's important because it's a very uh, good thing that you mm -hmm. uh, give the person that you are special and you are uh, the one that uh, you can uh, do your best in every field. So this just yes, gifts are like uh, these are very important because gifts are uh, these are like uh, it makes connection between a person mm -hmm. to person and do you think that price of gift or present is important no i think uh, in one well, my point of view uh, mm -hmm. price of gift is not important but the gift is very important yeah. okay now what's the difference between uh, a homemade gift and a shop bought gift uh, well, uh, the homemade gift, uh, it requires a lot of energy and uh, it requires a lot of time to prepare it and to for like if you uh, like your person 
and you are preparing by your own self so these include your dedication and your hard work that you are doing as compared to the shop gifts they are available in local markets and they are available earlier that you can just buy them and you go uh, get to your friends or families so these are quite easy okay yes so uh, do you have any favorite celebrity yes i have many favorite celebrities but uh, mm -hmm. the most famous are uh, which i uh, like the most from my uh, young ch from my childhood and from my uh, teenage that is mm -hmm. uh, bill gates and elon musk elon musk is currently the uh, owner of also the uh, twitter and also mm -hmm. he's running the tesla and he has many creative ideas also he introduced the new ai uh, technology and uh, he is performing best in his way so i think uh, i he is my favorite personality mm -hmm. and his favorite celebrity and do you have any national celebrity as well yes i have a favorite uh, favorite uh, celebrity that is uh, fawad khan fawad khan is a pers uh, doing great his in field mm -hmm. fawad khan is very famous for his looks and his personality and uh, and besides that i also like danish temur is a pakistani mm -hmm. actor mm -hmm. both has great personalities I and like would you want them. to be a celebrity in the future well if uh, if god give me a chance then i would be want to become a celebrity and how do uh, celebrities influence their fans in your country well in my country uh, celebrities use the uh, different techniques to attract their fans like their uh, by their looks mm -hmm. by their performance by their acting and uh, by their uh, like their how they dedicated to their work they are uh, doing best in their fields mm -hmm. so these are the things that I, i would say that these are things that people make to attract you and do you think that we should uh, we should uh, like you can say secure or we should save personal information of any celebrity or like because most mm -hmm. of the time uh, you can see that these days people are sharing the personal things of like you can uh, say uh, celebrities like actors or politicians and all this mm -hmm. well so what uh, do you think about it okay well ma'am in my point of view the personal information mm. should be a personal not be to be highlighted to every yeah. person because everyone have personal life and where we have mm. a professional life so we cannot uh, compare the personal life to prof professional life because everyone mm. has their own life and everyone has to right to live in their own way Okay. Yes. Now in the second part of your speaking test I would like to give you a cue card and your cue card is describe a creative person whose work you admire. Now uh, for the cue card you have just 1 minute to think about it. If you want to make notes you can make notes on this page as well. You have just 1 minute after that you have to speak at least 1 to 2 minutes. Okay. Just give me a cue. If you need pencil here is your pencil. Okay. Could you please start speaking now? Yes uh, in my life uh, I see a lot of persons around me they are very creative but the most uh, creative person uh, I would say that uh, is in my family mm. she is my sister and uh, she is pursuing her uh, uh, studies nowadays and uh, she is mm. very creative from his uh, like uh, when I was uh, young and I was in school life she used uh, different arts and crafts uh, things like uh, uh, she makes cups and she makes uh, different uh, flowers and she also uh done it course and she also have beautician course mm -hmm. like he uh, she has made, she i would say that she's multi talented and she uh, didn't sit in ideal like uh, if you uh, if you they give uh, any activity to the, uh, to her and she will perform his best and uh, and he and she is also uh, uh, good at it course and uh, programming and uh, he she's very creative because she has a uh, new ideas and uh, also uh, she do jute work on the mirror that mm. she can uh, draw, uh, make the different flowers and different designs of uh, uh, we can say the uh, on the mirrors and uh, she make also uh, the mirrors like uh, uh, beautiful like wall mirrors and where okay. the jute uh, are uh, where the rope are made around them and we are our rope are used for the wall mirrors and uh, i think she's uh, very creative and she's very creative person in my life good and i also inspired by by her mm. uh now in the last part of your speaking test yes you have some questions related to your cue card your cue card was describe a creative person whose work you admire do you think you are a creative person 
Yes, I think I am creative person. Hmm. Well, uh, I like to uh, that I am such a kind of person that who uh, like to different uh, participate in different kind of activities, hmm. and I like the creativity as uh, my and my inspiration. Like I told you earlier, that Elon Musk, Bill Gates, and uh, like uh, in our Pakistan, we also uh, see hmm. that some of the youngest childs like. Uh, Uh, Hamad Safi, Muhammad Asnain. Mm. These are like uh, um, uh, these are creative persons, and I also inspired by them. And uh, I want, uh, I like to be mm-hmm. a creative person because creative person has never ending uh, thoughts, never ending uh, thinking, <laughs> and he perform his best in his way. Is it good for children to learn arts? Yes. Uh, well, uh, the world is modernizing day by day, mm-hmm. and uh, children should uh, like perform, uh, do arts. Because there's in the children life, uh, we can uh, explore our uh, skill, uh, explore our qualities, explore our aptitudes, mm-hmm. that what kind of uh, abilities we have. So in a, a very childhood, so we can start and uh, on our skills, we can improve our skills and we can groom ourselves. So what kind of jobs require people to be creative? Well, uh, it depends on a person. Like you have different jobs. Like if you uh, you are beautician, mm-hmm. like uh, if you a person have beauty good uh, did beautician course, she can do uh, be- uh, she can open a beauty parlor, and if she is uh, running a like a small business on mm-hmm. her uh, home uh, him to hometown, and she can make some wall mir- uh, wall mirrors uh, decorated mirrors for the pers- for the customers, mm-hmm. and there are many ways like. Uh, it depends on the person, like what creative, uh, how creative he was. Do you think? Uh, yeah. Do you think leaders need to have a creative ability? Yes, uh, I think leaders are the very important for any nation. Mm-hmm. Uh, leaders are should be creative in their work because they leaders. Uh, the most of the followers uh, follow the leaders. If the leaders mm-hmm. are creative, then the followers will be creative. Okay, thank you so much. So this is the end of your speaking. Thank test. you.